on, so we're going to take a look at this 59. This is worthwhile just checking out even closer. It has the ghost flames in it. You see those ghost flames? Just beautiful. It goes back. I like the deep dish. Look at that offset. It's crazy. The flames go right back down to just above the arch. Automatic. I like the diamond plate in the back. These are such cool cars. Let's check out some more. Got a couple Fords over here. Got to check those out. Thirty-seven. These were just such iconic rods. Because really, what else could you buy with the V8? In those days, which were actually affordable. Cool. I like the moon pedal on the floor. I'll pull it in a minute. I just want to flip back for a second to the 37. I got to show you that shifter. Is that neat? I like that. This coupe is just beautiful. The lines on now. Just so fluid. Flipping over to his truck. Still has the three speed on the column. So about 54, somewhere around there. We're going to end it over here with the Model A. You would. You would. I can give it a half on the way, right? Unfortunately, so it's got a bow tie under the hood. Been there, done that, right? Not that but hey, they're out there. That's pretty good. Nice setting of Fords. Which rod would you pick up? I love this. This is so cool. Carl L. Ruth uh, Dino Tune-Ups, 470 horsepower. This was in 97. Nice. Nice. That is hot rodding, folks. Oh, 56. Sounding good. Ah, I love this GMC. Beautiful, 49, yep, 49. Followed by an old F85. A little bit of power with a 455 under the hood. That was a 64. There we go. For this uh, Plymouth also. This is beautiful. Anything with wood, baby. Anything with wood. Oh, that is nice. That is nice. 